Hey there, Ramon Osa with you here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to be faster on the court and develop better footwork. How does that sound? Let's get started. All right, it's the 800 pound gorilla in the room, or the court in this case, because you could have the most beautiful strokes in the world. You could look like the pros, but if you're not in position, the only time you're gonna get to use it is when you shadow swing. But not to fear, because I'm about to show you a little sequence that won't only make you a little bit faster, but will also make your footwork better. So I got my trusty friend, the uh, agility ladder here, which doubles as an escape route if you forgot to take out the trash and your wife is mad at you. All right, I'm far from the swiftest of foot here, but after adding this little routine to my regular workout, I can outrun just about every turtle in Los Angeles, and it'll certainly make you better and faster on the court. So here's how it goes. Start with one round of this, and as you progress, go up to two or three sets. Heck, do as many as you want, as long as you stay in control of your body. And the most important thing here is rhythm and balance. Try and keep your feet going nice and steadily throughout this sequence. And as you get the hang of it, you can go faster and faster, but keep your rhythm the entire time. Take breaks when you need to, and make sure to consult your doctor, warm up, wear good shoes, and all that good stuff. Up first is your good old fashioned one in, one out, just like you're running. And on the way back, start with your opposite foot. Easy, nothing to it. All right, next, it's time for the bunny hop, with or without uh, bunny arms or ears. Okay, next is the one-footed bunny hop. Now this one's a burner, and if you do it, make sure you switch it up to the other foot on the way back. Great way to build balance and power here. Then we're gonna do the split step. So your feet go in, they go out, and then they go in again, and in the next square, just like this. Okay, now how about the old sideways bunny hop? I've never actually seen a bunny hop sideways, but uh, this will help your lateral movement tremendously. Okay, not for the faint of heart, the one-footed sideways bunny hop. Uh, and if you did this one-footer, switch legs and go the other way on the way back. Now your legs may be on fire at this point, so take a breather if you need to. Okay, now the scissor goes like this. Each foot goes in each square, and then you go out and you go into the next one like this. And finally, the slalom. Now this one takes a little practice, but it's one foot out, one foot up. Other foot out, other foot up, like this. Take it slow at first and then speed it up later. And that's it. Make sure to stretch it out or if you're still good to go, wait for a minute or two, catch your breath, do some dynamic stretches and then go at it again. Thanks so much for watching this video. I had a great time making it for you as I enjoy making every video for you. If you like this video, do me a favor and click the like button. Let me know in the comments what you'd like to see in the next video. Please feel free to share this with a friend and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss next week's lesson. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.